Hey players, so I have a very disturbing update on NBA G League player Chance Comanche and his girlfriend, well ex-girlfriend, being arrested for the murder of Morena Rogers. Trigger warning, this is some graphic content. So last week, NBA G League player Chance Comanche was arrested by the FBI in California for the murder of his ex-girlfriend, Shakara Harden's friend, Morena Rogers. Now, Shakara Harden was arrested a week prior on felony theft and kidnapping charges of Morena Rogers. According to investigators, they were able to uncover evidence to show that uh, Chance Comanche and his girlfriend conspired to murder Morena Rogers and dump her body in a uh, Vegas desert. So yesterday, Chance Comanche was in court in California where he waived his right to extradition back to Vegas. And during this hearing, we were able to get some more information regarding the actual crime. So according to Las Vegas police records, Chance confessed that he helped his ex-girlfriend, Shakara Harden, murder Morena Rogers on December 6th and dump her body in the Vegas desert. So Chance came to Las Vegas on December 1st. He was scheduled to play in a basketball game for the Stockton Kings. He said on that same day, he met with Shakara Harden, who was having a problem with her friend, Morena Rogers. Shakar told him that Morena uh, stiffed her out of a Rolex watch. Apparently, they both were working as actual workers. Also, Shakara was upset with Morena because allegedly Morena was telling people that Shakari snitched on her ex-boyfriend who was arrested in California on double murder charges. So Shakari told Chance all of this, and for some reason, Chance felt compelled to help her with this situation. Now, they just met a year and a half ago on a dating app. They only dated for a few months. They broke up, but they still kept in touch. So according to text messages obtained by the police, they started trying to hire a hitman for $3,000. They actually spoke in a group chat with a third person who was supposed to help them with this situation, but that person did not end up coming through with a hitman. So Shakari and Chance decided to do it themselves. In the vile text messages, Shakari and Chance discussed multiple ways to snuff out Morena, including strangulation, poisoning, and also using a weapon. They ultimately decided to trick Morena into thinking that she was going to meet a customer that wanted some kinky activity that involved like tying people up and stuff like that. So on December 4th, Chance checked into the M Resort and Casino in Henderson, Nevada with the Kings and he played a basketball game the next day at the Dollar Loan Center. Following the game, he made his way back to his hotel with the team before he went back outside and got into the car with Shakari and they drove to meet Morena Rogers. So Shakari told Morena in text messages that the customer was going to pay them for services that included being tied up and having ooey gooey. So Morena agreed via text message. They got into the vehicle. They started removing their clothes. And uh, according to Chance, according to the police report, Chance told police that that's when he uh pulled out the HDMI card and strangled Morena for about 10 seconds. Now he said that Shakari eventually joined in and put her hands around Morena's uh, neck and ended her life. The two checked for a pulse and determined that she was dead when they saw fluid coming out of her mouth. She was defenseless. She was tied with zip tied. She could not help herself. So after it was over, they pulled over to the side of the road in Henderson, Nevada and dumped her body in a ditch and covered her with rocks. They then smashed Morena Rogers' phone and drove back to the hotel where they stayed until Chance left with the team around 8.50 a.m. Now, after the egregious act, the two stayed in contact. According to police, Chance was coaching Shikari on what to say once the police start questioning her. So Shikari was arrested first and charged with felony first-degree kidnapping and felony theft for allegedly stealing a Rolex value between $5,000 to $25,000. Um, of course, we know FBI agents arrested Chance Comanche on first-degree kidnapping charge on De December 15th, 
and that's where they ultimately got the confession and they were able to recover Morena's body in the desert. I declare, honey, what a disgrace. So they've taken a life, affected an entire family, ruined their own lives. It's over for them, honey. All for a Rolex watch and a rumor. This is ridiculous. So Chance is going to be extradited back to Vegas where he will officially be charged with uh, Morena, Morena's death. And uh, Shakari is currently being held behind bars. Uh, she's going to be facing a judge very soon. All right, players, put your thoughts in the comments. Let me know what you're thinking. This is Double D Mova reporting for the Black Good News.